Uh, I was sifting through the thousands of reader questions that we had. And we actually had another one I thought was great from Don in Cedar Rapids. So, Graham. Oh, Don's back? Don's back. So, if you don't mind. We must have really helped him out. I think we did. Um, You know, we talked to him about a lot of really good things on the last episode. So, I'm excited to uh, hear what he has to say this week. I'm hopeful that we can help him out. Judging by his punctuation, he hasn't gotten his blood pressure checked. Yeah, it was high last time, and it seems to only have gotten higher, which it's I'm, like he's, I'm a little worried about, but uh, what are you going to do? It looks like he's been sitting there watching the Amazon delivery tracker all day. But to be fair, we've all been there, where you're just kind of like watching it and just ready to see what happens. Don't tell me it's out for delivery if it's not out for delivery! <laughs> That's our Don. Let's read this. All right, let's hear what he has. Don S. from Cedar Rapids, Iowa. Thanks for writing back, Don. Dear Sports, last week I was minding my own business, selling tamales from the back of my Nissan Maxima, as one does on Tuesdays. While following your advice and talking about the MLB playoffs, My customer, whom we will call Greg, asked if I saw that guy that got the golden sombrero. My question is, was this a hate crime or was this a sports reference? Please advise, Don. 